My name is Douglas Chong. I'm a smart grid design engineer and project manager at Hitachi Europe. I started off as an electrical and electronic engineer. I liked the idea of implementing things that people could use. The area of smart grids really interested me because with smart grids you're, you're giving people, uh, making them more aware of what's happening and their energy usage. And a lot of people have talked about smart grids, smart cities, and what the next thing will be, and I really wanted to be a part of that. What I love about this job is uh, the new technologies that we can see in the smart grid space, smart cities, and the fact that we can use the current resources much more efficiently so that for the next few generations, I'll know that you know, they can have a better life. If we were to implement smart grids today, the first step would be to install smart meters or some kind of monitoring in people's homes. Apart from knowing exactly how much energy you're using, um, it then makes you more aware and for you to then lower your energy consumption. So there are schemes, for example, in Japan where you can see how much your neighbor is using and they run competitions. So you could get points, it could be a points reward scheme, it could be a money, you know, it could be just a game. And you could compete with your neighbors or with your neighborhood to see, you know, who has the lowest energy consumption. In terms of uh, electricity use, if we're talking about domestically, um, heat accounts for over 60% of domestic space heating and then another 22% is hot water. So you're talking about the majority of home use is heating. So that's why there, right now there's a big push for electrification of heat um, into heat pumps. So if you have traditional electric heaters, um, that is essentially for every kilowatt of heat, you're using one kilowatt of power. But with heat pumps, it's down to a third of that. There is a project that we're involved in Manchester right now. It's called the Manchester Smart Community Demonstration Project. The idea of the project is to help residents uh, with fuel poverty. And by that, I mean instead of using electricity in electrical heaters, we give them heat pumps which are much more efficient. There's a smart grid uh, rollout plan now that the government has implemented. And I think by 2020, pretty much everyone would have a smart meter. I think if we don't start adopting uh, smart grid technologies, then I think the percentage or the chance of having brownouts and blackouts would increase. Ultimately, you don't want that. You want to help uh, the UK meet its carbon targets, and at the same time, you want to reduce your electricity costs. For me, social innovation is empowering people and allowing them to do more intelligent things with uh, the resources they have around them and giving them all the information that is collected so that they're able to do these things.